Hear ye, hear ye, hear ye. His Majesty the King of Instruments is very concerned that the youngest people of the land do not know of his greatness. Therefore, he invites all boys and girls to draw near and hear for themselves the many splendid sounds that make up his royal realm. To help us heed this royal call, we'll use a tune that's known to all. Now, since you know this little song, you may wish to sing along. Where this tune now leads to sound of pipes, flues, and reeds. Pride of place belongs to the principles, polished and powerful. They parade in front of the other pipes. Their primary purpose when played is to provide support for people to him their praise. Silky smooth, soft and sweet, strings have a special sound that is shimmering and delicious. They seem to say, be very still and listen, listen, listen.
rich and raucous, the rowdy reeds are next in line to lift their raspy voices. These rascals are always ready to raise a racket. <laughs> Friendly and frilly, the frisky flutes are apt to flutter, even behind a shutter. High and low and in between, their fine, clear sound is just the thing to top off the organ with fluffy frosting. The organ has several keyboards, not just one, a fact which is really rather neat. The biggest keys are called the pedals because they're played by the performer's feet. A manual is a keyboard played by the organist's hands. An organ has more than one, so two parts are clear. Understand? Sometimes the pedals like to get in the act. They just drone on, and that's a fact. And now we put it all together. Principles and reeds, flutes and strings, manuals and pedals and all those things. A joyful noise that shakes the ground. Together they make a majestic sound. Of all the instruments, surely this is the king. His royal sound will rattle the rafters and make this building ring. <laughs> 